hi everyone welcome or welcome back to my channel and if you're new here my name is tay and you're watching tay budgets okay yeah about this so first of all if you hear an echo i am filming in a new part in my house i'm still trying to figure out where's the best place to film right now because my room is under renovation so i don't film in my room currently um so but i got a new desk this is it well this is the desk that's going to be in my room so this is the desk that i'll be filming off of um when i do get my room done and i'm so excited i'm really excited because like look how much space i have it's more cleaner and like let me just move this a little bit it's more cleaner and it's just it just it just does what it has to do right so yeah all right um but yeah if you do hear echo that's my dilemma uh i thought i had to get something in here but i guess not okay let's put that to the side oh okay can you all see me i hope so okay all right so we're gonna empty the cash wallet first i have some kind of exciting but not so exciting news to tell you guys so i'm gonna be starting my debt journey i'm gonna be starting my debt journey and i have a lot of debt and you know that's something that i've been running away from but it's time for me to tackle it but before we do so we're gonna empty this wallet so we have a lot of receipts you know my cash wallet broke um these coins are three you know four weeks worth of coins so I didn't empty it last week. And I have a lot of receipts right here, which needs to get scanned into Fetch Rewards. If you do not know about Fetch Girl, it's an app where you can scan any receipt as long as it's a transaction within 14 days. You upload it to the app and you get points, you accumulate points, and those points turn into rewards that you can use at um, in-person stores or online, such as Amazon, uh, I don't know if they have eBay. Uh, probably Amazon. So far, I've seen Amazon, Bahama Breeze, Red Lobster, Home Depot, Lowe's, like stuff like that. So I have to scan in all of these. This is probably too late for these receipts right here because I had these receipts for probably more than two weeks. Girl, I feel like because my wallet broke, I um, I even have receipts in here. I because my wallet broke, right? I have not been unstuffing my uh binder and on top of that um majority of my envelopes the zipper part broke so that's what i'm battling with right now so we're going to start in the beginning so i did go on a, an adventure as i told you guys i had a passing in my family so i had to travel to another state to go to the funeral so i did take out a good amount for um my cash wallet so i do have some left over some of it is going to be rollover um so i'm going to use it again or it's either going to be um stuff into savings challenges if you have not watched my my uh recent videos you guys can go ahead and go over and watch my recent videos of course after you watch this video because i wouldn't want you to go now all right so from food we have one two three four oh we got a 20. oh Whoa, we got a hold on wait 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 i'm shook i thought i had only once wait let's start again let's start from the big the big the big boys all right so we got 20 right we got 25 30 dollars 31 32 33 34 35 36 37 dollars so we have 30 what's 37 dollars should probably roll this over because i'm planning on doing a meal prep and i'm also going to be if you guys don't know well i don't really talk about my faith so much on this channel um but i am a christian pentecostal um it's another form of christianity just another branch i am thinking about doing something that's going to save me money so i'm probably going to roll this over and put it back right into food into my food envelope so when i do do grocery shopping I'll be able to meal prep, okay? So gas, gas has money! Girl, gas has more money than this, but I don't know. Well, I spent 30 something on gas, 
and now I'm left with 20, 21, 22. Okay, so we can move this up here, right? And then we have $22, okay? And then laundry, I did go to the laundry and I did use whatever that was in laundry that was in my cash binders, not cash, well, my high, I think it was in my high priority binder. Miscellaneous had a lot of money and I've used, used, used it. Um, and miscellaneous is only gonna have, at the end of the day, only has $3. So, I need to keep it like this. Yeah, keep it like that. All right, so let's count how much we saved in um, 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 two plus weeks because this I went on my road trip in the beginning of February it was February 11th no February 10th and now today is February 23rd so that is about two weeks and, and some days so let's count how much we have saved so we have 20 20 well, let's just put it together girl Golly. All right. So we have 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 62. We have $62 saved. Like, wow. Wow, wow, wow. So we're going to put this here in the back. And um, we, go, we are going to stuff these coins. We are, I, I know this is more than $3. Like, how much is my coin jar at right now? My coin jar is currently at 46.18 and after I stuff, I know I'm going to have a lot of money. So we're going to put all of that on the side and we're going to get right into our high priority and low priority binders. And that's what y'all came here for, right? Right, right, right. So let me take out my calculator because sometimes I'll be bugging and I don't know how to count. All right, so let's set this up here. You guys can't see. Um, so we have... Um, we have bills, high priority, low priority. So we have three binders. So let's get started, starting with bills. All right, so probably have to move that over here to the side. And my breakdown, I did a spreadsheet on Google Docs. So that's what I'll be looking at from the side over here. I'm usually on paper, but I can't. I'm still trying to figure out my way, y'all. All right, so. Of course, we have our binder of contents and we're stuffing what's most important. So Amazon Prime, don't start with the notification because last time it had notification. I can't do that. All right. Last time Amazon was not, did Amazon get something last time? I don't know. But where am I taking from? Amazon is getting 25, so it's getting a 20 and a 5. So we have 25, 35, 36. $36 in Amazon Prime because I, I don't know, Amazon is tripping. So as long as I put something in there so I could pay back that credit card, although I was done paying the credit card, it charged the credit card instead of charging my card because I purchased some furniture for my room and you know, it's whatever. Anyways, Bills is not getting anything so let's close that, don't know why that's open. I am uh, half, a, half a bill ahead in my car insurance so car insurance is going to be getting uh twenty dollars so we have 20 40 60 80 100 102 102 so yeah so i'm still a bill ahead i was thinking about putting 40 in car insurance but it is what it is it is what it is babes all right next is cell phone Cell phone, I got the, I, this is it. Um, I pay my phone bill every eighth of the month and I have to put in $100. I am on a family plan. Well, it's my family plan. Like, it's me, uh, my sister, and my, another family re relative. <clears throat> I can't get my words out today. So, I have to put in $100. You know, I'm the big girl, I guess. So, um, I put in $100. And I also did upgrade my phone to the 14 plus, so I have to be paying that because, uh, yeah, that part. Uh, I don't usually take out phones, but girl. Anyways, so, girl, tell me why, mm, on this budgeting journey, y'all, we go through some credit card debt, we go through some student loans and all of that. And the reason why we do this budgeting and this cash budgeting system and this, you know, 
uh, breaking down your, your paycheck, if you get paid weekly, bi-weekly, if you're on a salary-based salary income. The reason why we do this is to get out of debt. And this, 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 this two letter, this two word right here, how much letters? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. This ten letter word right here will get you in trouble, okay? I need to pay off my credit card. So, I'm tired of seeing it. I'm tired. I don't even want to use it anymore. I haven't been using it. You know what? We're not going to talk about it. It's getting $200 today. This is the biggest I've ever stuffed in credit card. But it's getting $200. So, we're at, this is $250. But I'm going to count for you guys because it's very aesthetically pleasing to hear, I guess. So we have 50, 100, 150, 200, 250. And this is going all towards credit card. And like I said, Amazon's been playing with me. So, you know, I've reached the limit on the credit card, but it keeps charging stuff to that credit card into the Amazon card instead of using my other card that I have on file. You know what? It's all good, it's all cool, it's all good in the hood. Um, oh, my phone locked. All right, so next phone pay off. This also goes towards my phone bill, but I have this just in case, you know, of a buffer to fall back on. Just, just in case if I'm $2 short on my bill, you know, because I am still paying for the phone and it's included in my bill. So I might as well just make an envelope for that. I don't stuff that all the time, but when I do stuff it, I stuff a little, a little $2, $1 won't hurt, you know, um, because it did help me, um, on my previous spell next is p.o box i did open a p.o box guys it is in my description box just in case if you guys want to send me literally anything i haven't checked my p.o box since i've opened it but i would really love to see like something like that you guys are watching that you guys you know send me a letter like encouraging letter or anything i would really love to see it um, student loans, so something is coming with student loans and debt and all of that. So I didn't even stuff this. I decided that I'm going to be doing challenges to, um, you know, tackle my student debt and credit card debt and all of that. But I'm still going to be paying the minimum payments on the credit card until then. Okay, because I didn't get a thumbnail, so I had to get that thumbnail repeat that a year and you ain't any moment. Yeah, anyway, so where are we? We are at high priority. That high priority. Can I can I do it? Can I turn the thing though? Alright, so first is business. So guys. Oh, I'm moving my camera. Let me see if I can put these over here. Yeah, that's better. All right, so I've been making stuff and posting stuff on my Etsy. And if you guys are interested in any budgeting items, they are on my Etsy. And girl, just go check it out. Go buy a little something, something, you know, support um, a growing business. I'm not a small business. I'm a growing business. Um, I've watched this video and it says never claim small over your business. So that's what I'm not going to do. One of the products, I'm going to show you guys one of the products that I've been working on. It is limited edition. This is literally the only one. Um, but it's this Bedazzle Binder. Now, this is pretty, This is on the expensive side only because it took me seven days to make. So, it's a little, <laughs> it's a, it's a little pretty penny. Um, and I know that we are on this little, this budgeting journey and everything. And I posted this on a platform and someone commented that you know you don't have to spend so much on a budgeting binder uh, you can go to the dollar store um, but it, it doesn't matter like you know it's what someone feels that is comfortable for them so I know that I'm not going to be um, consistent with my budgeting journey if I'm you know budgeting out of a bind out of a plain binder like that's not me like you know yourself and you know your limits right so this is something that i would buy you know btw this binder is 60 dollars only because it took so much time and you know time is money right um so yeah like of course the back isn't covered but you know i'll be making some with the back and front covered time this took so much time y'all and it is so beautiful at the end of the day um and someone will buy it someone will eventually 
buy this binder but i just wanted to show you guys one of the products that i had on my etsy this is currently listed on my etsy bw and my etsy is also in the description box i do have other stuff i talk really fast right mm -hmm. i know i have other stuff listed on my etsy but these are just this is just one of the something big that i've accomplished um in this business let's just getting that done like i've always wanted to do that and the fact that i i've done it it's beautiful anyways I mean, I was on business, so I might as well just spill the beans on it, right? All right, anyways. Business gets $50 today. Because I had to make a purchase with this business the other day, y'all. And I had to take it from another envelope. And I was like, girl, you shouldn't have done that. But this is still a process. All right, next is car maintenance. Um, I need to start stuffing a good amount of car maintenance because literally anything can happen at any time with my car, especially it being 14 years old. I have an Acura TL 2007, and it's currently 2023. So I do need to start stuffing something in car maintenance. My camera... Y'all, I need a new camera. My camera literally just shut off. I don't even know where you. what was the last thing you guys heard. But groceries, I put in... I put in $50. So now it has um, $60. Last time I went $0.83 cents over, but that was only because I had to buy a reusable bag. Next is laundry. Laundry is going to be getting a $10 bill. Okay. Oh, I know why I got to the 16 minute mark because I only could record for 16 minutes. That makes so much sense. All right. Okay. Miscellaneous. If this thing turn off one more time. Miscellaneous is getting forty dollars. Okay. Come on. Open the thing. And it already has a 20, so in all it has $60. I tried to stuff 20 a week just to, you know, say, hey, yo, calm down, bro. You don't need $60 in miscellaneous. <laughs> room decor, because I need to buy some more stuff for my room. Um, It's getting $40, because now I need to buy my bed sheets. What else do I need to buy? I need to buy bed sheets, a satin pillowcase. I'm getting to the the end of, of furniture buying i decided so i already have a mattress but i was gonna buy a new mattress but i'm like girl you already have a mattress you don't need a mattress um of course i would love some luxury to sleep on because i'm a rich auntie you know i'm cl i claim that over my life rich auntie all the time because i am an aunt and i just put rich beside it so i'm a rich auntie why not all right but yeah oh guys you guys didn't comment in my last videos um, would you guys like to see a bill exchange? I'm gonna do it anyway. I say it all the time, but I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it for y'all. Even though y'all ain't say nothing to me, I'm gonna still do it. So, Ty's is getting $80 today. I, I say it in every video. But I do not count my Ty's. I mean, you guys don't have a problem with that, right? Right? But give God 10% back of what you earn. I was thinking the other day, like, you know, God blessed me with a job. He gave me strength to get up and go work. He He keeps me safe to drive to and fro, you know. Um, and, you know, I get paid. So the least I could do is give him back 10% of my earnings. Yes. Next, we're going to be stuffing oh, the devil. Devil, he learns from your mistakes. Come on now. I love singing. I just don't sing like that no more. Um, probably one day. Next is adventure. Oh, the only thing that's getting something is birthday because my birthday is next week. By the time I post this video, my birthday will be next week. Yep. Yeah. My birthday is March 9th. So just in case if you guys want to send me anything in my P.O. box, I'm here for it. A letter, anything, savings challenges. I'm here for it. I do have to buy some stuff for my birthday outfits, meaning because 
I didn't do anything for my last birthday. I didn't go out to eat. I didn't do anything. So I said, you know what? I'm going to do something for my birthday this year. So birthday is getting $40. My last two 20s. So it has 20, 60, 70, 80, 90, oh, 100? No. You'll see your ass. Hold on. Give me a second. 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 105, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Yo, this just had $99. You sure I'm counting? I probably am not counting right because I can't believe in myself. Let me let me bring in the calculator for y'all because I probably am not counting right. 60, 10, 20, 30, 40. Did somebody put stuff something in here? 5, 10, 15, 20, 20, 25, 30. You get out. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 139. I was just at $99. What? How? Well, I just added a 40 in there, so hello. Operator. Hello. Operator. I should have put money in Adventure to go towards my birthday. Yeah. Yeah. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to... Buy my birthday outfits with this. Yeah. And then I do get paid the day before my birthday. So I'll just take out a good amount and put it in adventure. Because I did make a little itinerary for myself. You know, I'm going to be doing stuff myself for my birthday. Because, you know, you got to take care of yourself before someone else does. You know what I mean? Self-love is the best love. So that's what I'm doing. Right? Oh, that's it. Christmas, I'm doing a saving challenge towards that. Craft room supplies, girl, stop buying stuff. <laughs> Education, didn't really stuff that. Gifts, the only gifts I should be putting in is for myself. There's some stuff on my on my wish list that I really, really want for my birthday, but we'll see how that goes. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys made it to this point, that means you made it to the end. There's some more money left over. I know. Stay tuned. And uh, watch out for my next video because that's where I'll be stuffing the rest of this money. Well, the next two videos. <laughs> that's where I'll be stuffing the rest of this money. So if you guys want to see that video, make sure you guys keep your post notifications on. Or turn them on if they're not on already. So you guys will keep keeping a loop of when I post the next video. Alright? So thank you guys so much for watching. Bye! Oh, do you guys like my new intro? Ah! This, I love this intro. It took me like 10 minutes to make. Do you guys love the intro? Comment down below if you guys love the intro. And recently, my comments has been disabled. I had to like manually turn them back on. But hopefully the comments are on for this video. So comment down below if you liked my new intro. Because I loved it. Alright. Bye everybody. See you guys in the next video. Stay safe. Stay blessed. And I'll, I, I'll catch you later. I was about to say see you in the next video. Okay, bye.